Bible bloopers. It is truly astonishing what happens in Bible stories when they are retold by young scholars around the world. In the first book of the Bible, in his eyes, God got tired of creating the world, so he took the Sabbath off. Adam and Eve were created from an apple tree. Noah's wife was called Joan of Ark. Noah built an ark, which the animals came on to in pairs. Lot's wife was a pillar of salt by day, but a ball of fire by night. The Jews were a proud people and throughout history they had trouble with the unsympathetic generals. Samson was a strongman who let himself be led astray by a Jezebel like Delilah. Samson slayed the Philistines with the axe of the apostles. Moses led the Hebrews to the Red Sea, where they made unleavened bread, which is bread made without any ingredients. The Egyptians were all drowned in the desert. Afterwards, Moses went upon Mount Sinai to get the Ten Commandments. The first commandment was when Eve told Adam to eat the apple. The fifth commandment is to humor thy father and mother. The seventh commandment is thou shalt not admit adultery. Moses died before he ever reached Canada. Then Joshua led the Hebrews in the battle of Jericho. The greatest miracle in the Bible is when Joshua told his son to stand still and he obeyed him. David was a Hebrew king skilled at playing the lyre. He fought with the Finklestines the race of people who lived in biblical times. Solomon, one of David's sons, had three hundred wives and seven hundred porcupines. When Mary heard that she was the mother of Jesus, she sang the Magna Carta. When the three wise guys from the east side arrived, they found Jesus in the manager. Jesus was born because Mary had an immaculate contraption. Street John, the blacksmith, dumped water on his head. Jesus enunciated the golden rule which says to do one to others before they do one to you. He also explained, man does not live by sweat alone. It was a miracle when Jesus rose from the dead and managed to get the tombstone off the entrance. The people who followed the Lord were called the Thirteen Decibels. The epistles were the wives of the apostles. One of the possums was Street. Matthew who was by profession, a tax seaman. Street. Paul converted to Christianity. He preached holy acrimony, which is another name for marriage. The Christian should have only one wife. This is called monotony. This one happened on an exam. One of the students identified the rainbow as the Ark of the Covenant. Also a true story. The teacher asked her class to draw a picture of the Holy Family and one child drew a rather large figure as part of his threesome, explaining that they were round John Virgin, mother and child. The Sunday school teacher was describing how Lot's wife looked back and suddenly turned into a pillar of salt. My mother looked back while she was driving, contributed little Johnny, and she turned into a telephone pole.